All right, guys. I'm still tired from last weekend. Are you tired, Kelvin? Uh, I'm I'm okay, but you still have like a massive. Well, we all have uh, a massive weekend coming up. Yeah, it's like I don't know. It's hard recovering nowadays, and then it's also really cold. Like, man, like we're all wearing this. Yeah, but this gets wearing shorts, so it's just shorts, dude. You know, it's just shorts. It's not about the bottom half. It's about the top half. Sure. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, no, that's why we're looking like we're, uh, we're, we're senile or something. But, you know, you still have to troop on. And this week we have a crazy amount of decks. Because wow. it's basically just all foreign decks. You know, <laughs> everyone posting their tops or their non-tops. I mean, but we'll let it pass. We'll let it pass. It was like good vibes, right? This weekend was good vibes. We're going to expect more like next week, oh, yeah. I assume. Like everyone posting their D&V Prem decks. Yep. Um, so you probably need to take leave on Thursday. So Technically, so, okay. <laughs> last week we had three times eight top eights. Yeah, so that was pretty good. Next weekend we'll have um, yeah. six times. Uh, All right, yeah. prep up. Yeah, probably need uh, yeah, take leave on ops. Thursday to go through the the hundred billion decks that are gonna come through <laughs> the VG top deck. <laughs> That's all right. That's all right. We're doing it for you guys. Cause yeah. All right, so. <laughs> Let's. What's been hap happening? Um, there's a Dragon Empire deck here. Let's, we'll start now. We'll very, start. very bling. Yeah, I think we've seen this deck before. Yeah, I, I swear so. I've seen this deck too. Yep. <laughs> like the same guy, same mat. Mm -hmm. It's like the Korean. Is that a Korean Yu-Gi-Oh mat? Is that a Korean? Yeah, it looks yeah. like it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think we saw this exact deck last week. Um, and yeah, these, you've got the the new festival My Myron, right? New festival mm -hmm. fiction stuff. So overall, the rest of the deck hasn't really changed. So let's just go through this quickly. Let's go through this quickly to the cool stuff, right? Um, again, yeah, you, you have the two Myron. Very standard uh, arena that? deck. Uh, let's see. Uh, we've seen the... this before. This is uh, Oh, yeah, it's this guy. Yeah, yeah, it's this guy, hey. So same guys are topping or winning. Mm -hmm. um, so pretty good. They've got Shadow vs. Playmat. Super nice. Yeah, by the way, the VG top deck stuff is at the end of every section, just in case you guys don't know yet. Mm -hmm. uh, next, we've got another one. Everyone's getting high rarity. Okay, yeah, right. I mean, that's the nice thing about Overdress, right? The high rarity stuff is actually in high supply, so you can just bling out your deck, and it's not yeah. too expensive. This guy still hasn't seen the memo, though. He's still playing Tengestead, so... <laughs> Tengest no, but Tengestead's SP, remember? Mm, oh, yeah, true, true. And but you can run Myron. You can run Myron. That's hollow as well. Yeah, but SP, man. Mm, SP mm. trigger's coming up. That's gonna be nice. Okay, nice. All right, this one is another one. Uh, this guy did a good... Look at that. Look at that. Look at this dude. Nice. He's got like a funky sign on his playmate, but I don't know which one that is. Oh, it's a real sign. Wow. Yeah, it looks like it. All right, so this like one's pretty bug. good. This is a pretty, pretty nice deck. <laughs> uh, and then now we're on to the English side. Uh, nice. This guy is pretty hollow, eh? SP. Yeah. Oh, he's missing one. <sniffs> Nearly there, mate. Oh, he's running Tricks to Starter. All right, Tricks okay. to Starter. Interesting. Um, he, he topped after 2,000 years. <laughs> package. Wow. The prison matchup is sadly one-sided. You mean one-sided for you, right? Just watch our video if you don't know how to play the prison matchup. It's literally free for, for Nirvana. <laughs> Everything. No, no, no. Stoikea. Not this. It's not free. Just, Fine. Yeah, but yeah, this is this is pretty decent. Might want to go back to like the uh, the starter. The egg starter. Yeah. I'm not sure how aggressive you want to be, but egg mm. starter kind of phased out. But if you want to check out. How to be prison with Nevada, go check out one of our videos. I think it's like me and Mark were testing it. Uh, and then it's so a good job. And then also we've got Iki. Is this Ryan again? Dude. How many weeks is this, dude? It's like, how many what? streaks is that? Three, four? Like, I don't know. Like, I think it's like ages. I don't know how Ryan does it, man. He's still playing this 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 deck and he's still topping. It's a good job. First place by Rina. Second place was Bastion. Mm -hmm. um, is this Control Bastion? Nah, it's face. Mm -hmm. Face Bastion. Face Bastion. Yeah. Third place is Bastion as, as well. This is Control. Is it ba Control? Do I see this? It's got There's oh, no well, events though. Just the Great One. I mean, yeah. No, but some people say well, if you play Great One, that's a Control Bastion. Oh, right. And then fourth was Bastion. <laughs> wow. Great One. In Indonesian so Bastion. This one Varina guy just like beats yeah. everyone. I don't know what. I, I didn't know if Varina was a good matchup against Face Bastion, dude. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Uh, now, since cards are out in English, there's always going to be one guy playing Eugene, it seems. I, I'm ready for that. Uh, he's only running three of the Triceratops, which is interesting. Um, but otherwise, well, 12k pretty. attacker? Really? One Random Blautra? Yeah, this is best team, best girl. Okay. Alright, so good job mm -hmm. on uh, 
on, on winning winning with uh, Eugene. <laughs> until I, I have to, he got third place though, so I guess he didn't win. I have oh. to play this until I win a tournament, yep. so expect better more. Do. All right, better try hard, mate. Uh, moving on, that's the only Eugene. Uh, we've got Bruce, right? Bruce is once mm -hmm. again dominating, or still dominating. Uh, this is Japan. Um, I think with Dark States Clan, I think the, the thing we have to look out to are they running Dark States Over Trigger yep. or the Clay Elemental one. Um, so that'll be interesting to see. He's not running any Jareds, he's just running Brodies, mm -hmm. favoring the defense. So that's that's all right. Um, this guy, next, next person. Runs Vanilla Over Trigger. Is he only a One and Eden? One Eden feels. Good. One Eden feels really wrong. Yeah. Eden is such Eden a good card. Yeah, no joke. Eden. Missing not a fan, game. not a fan. Uh, but we're already into we're already into VG top Dex land. So this is a Singapore. This is Mervin, uh, familiar name. And um, are you running Jared, sir? No, mm. he's got Brody though. Okay, I'm 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 a good fan of Brody. He's running three Eden, three Eden. Why three Eden? Do you actually use that much counter blast? Like if you're really use if you're really abusing Colossus. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, all right. Good stuff. Uh, second place was uh, Hexa Orb. Okay. Oh no, wait, no, Mervyn wasn't running first place, Mervyn's third place, so Hexorb, wow, oh. Hexorb, we haven't seen this in a while. Um, but yeah, nice, uh, just... It's a, it's a free deck. Yeah, yeah, it's a pretty free deck, it's basically Bastion except not. Yeah. <laughs> and then third place was Mervyn, okay, so, ah. this is the familiar list that we all know and love. Got the, uh, you know, just the only running One the barrow. two. Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, it's, it's just, just, you see, you see a list like this with two barrows, and you're like, it's definitely Mervyn's list. This guy know where fun is at. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Like, so. yeah, he's got the six Keter SP, yeah. so good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Nice. Good job, mate. Uh, next, we've got uh, Malik. Malik. Mm. So uh, you got just a pretty standard Bruce deck now. Is it? Does Bruce run Brother Soul? No. <laughs> so I guess it's not standard. He's got five fronts as well. Yeah. yeah this one's kind of weird, actually. List, actually. Do you actually need Brother Soul? Because there's so many mm. other things that can soul charge. Like Marjorie's. Yeah. Or, uh. Or, or, wait, he's. Is this. This is a Japanese build as well, right? This is mm. like. Mm. Yeah, that's a new card. This is Jared, so. Interesting. Uh, this is pretty interesting. But why Brother Soul? Why do you yeah, need why, this? Yeah, why do you need it? I feel like this could just be anything else. Like more Acrobats. Yep. More Gunganiers. Gungaram. I think not Gunganier. You yeah. don't need that many Soul Charge. Or like more Your Edens, cards Edens. naturally Soul Charge. I think. Yeah. Uh. Oh, wait, hang on. There's more. I think there was more. Second place was Bastion. Oh, oh, this, oh this is new, updated. Updated Bastion, yeah, not Control Bastion. Mm -hmm. It's kind of weird, um, but all right, that's cool. It's still running four Dark Strains. All Dark Strains are getting phased out. Uh, and then lastly, we've got a Barrow Magnus Egg. Mm -hmm. So this this is not not this an all-in Barrow Magnus Egg. It's a very standard one, like high defense, high defense Barrow. Are we, are we looking at that? But it looks pretty old. No, it's like two. He's only running two barrows, though, right? Yeah. Well, not even two barrows. One, one barrow. One. So. Cut Persona Ride to mm -hmm. get more Colossus. So he can speed, but he's also running more defense here. Mm -hmm. That's so, pretty interesting. That's not pretty... running any draws as well. Yeah, that's a pretty so, interesting yeah. take, I guess. Because um, one of the biggest weaknesses with all in barrow is you have no defense. Yep. So if they crit you, you might just die. If you're running like, something like this, maybe you can live a bit longer. Full on 15k, yeah. yeah. Okay, alright, that's cool. Um, next one, yeah, we got Bruce. Uh, this is Dexcavate. Hmm? We've got third place at Triple Sleeve TCG's uh, Cruise Nest Tournament. Hmm. Okay, so good good job. Um, pretty standard Bruce. Really I think I think English has just picked up on just running uh, Electro Spartan hmm. with the Gungram kind of combo. I think that's... Kind of works out, yeah. Yeah. Well, lots of five fronts as well. That's, that's alright. Good job. Uh, next we've got uh, Zephy. And uh, it's got a ooh, mm. nice, nice hollow yeah, Bruce. He's slowly upping it up. It is like reverse. It's like mirrored, <laughs> mirrored Bruce. Yeah, so. Cool. Oh, I think he just reversed. No. Jared's? He's Jared's? Just, he just reversed the photo for some reason. Yeah. Yeah, Jared's and Eden. Nice. Um, a full complement of them as well. Mm. And then cutting here. He's got Brody. So he's basically got everything. This is this is a deck I can I can accept. I can give a thumbs up to. Alright, uh, second place was like Gotobun. Was it? Bastion? No, <laughs> no, it's, it's Magnolia, Magnolia dude. <laughs> Pure Magnolia, it seems. Um, oh, he's running, he's running the, actually the 15k. No. Actually the 15k dude. At the yeah, back. Still don't have like good methods of like plusing, so I uh, guess. 
Well, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. 15k, dude. Feels a bit low value, but... And then third place, we got Barrow Magnus. Okay. Um, and yeah, just a standard Barrow Magnus build, it seems. Hmm. Uh, it's all four. Normally, they cut down on one here, but it's fine. It's kind of kind of all in. Kind of all in. Uh, and then last of the Bruces, we have a John LeBron uh, with a... He got first in his local, so... Yeah, good job, man. So uh, pretty pretty standard, I guess. And lots of Brodies. Mm -hmm. I always like seeing lots of Brodies. Brodies are cool. And uh, yeah, one one Colossus. One Colossus, man. All right, good, good stuff, good stuff. All right, Barrow Magnus time. All right, JP Barrow Magnus. Let's see how we, many we've got this time. Yeah, we see no Dark States over trigger here. Mm -hmm. They put in this one. Because I guess it's pretty it's cool, right? Yeah. If you if you pop in your guys and they pop out. Yep, and, and the button becomes like a... Yeah, trigger 100, 100 million yeah. is, is yeah. pretty decent. Uh, otherwise, the rest of this deck is just pretty, mm -hmm. like, kind of standard, I guess. Only one Brother Soul. <laughs> mm. Alright. Go for 10. Yeah, yeah. Uh, next one, we have one TD Brother Soul. So, <laughs> remember, these only come in threes. Yeah. So, uh, you have to buy twos. Two of them. This is running old Dark States over trick, but the rest of the deck is just pretty, just pretty standard, I guess. Mm -hmm. Pretty standard by now. Uh, next we have is another flip one TD. Art. One T yeah, flip one as well. What's all the flips? One TD Brother Soul with kind of like, I guess, kind of a hybrid, mm. kind of hybrid here. Not running any crawling, it seems. So, yeah, just kind of defensive as well, trying to get a good middle ground. And then this other one, he could have set, he could afford two TDs. So four Brother Soul with the okay. Craig Elemental Over Trigger. Lots of just lots of orders. Pretty pretty standard, I guess. Only pretty one standard. Sonicer? Two Sonic, two, two Sonic, okay, okay, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Still. So, all right, that's okay. Well, I mean, we've seen like two Sonic builds quite a lot because yeah. they don't want to cut their Baron Magnus. Yeah, but, yeah, it's all right. Uh, and then here's another one. That's a whole lot of Baron Magnus this time. Yeah, Baron Magnus is rep repping, man. Um, again, the heavy two TD builds, mm -hmm. multiple TD builds, pretty similar to the previous end, deck yeah. as well. Two Sonic deck, and then now we're into the English format. VG top decks got Brunei, so uh, first place is Azar. With his Barrow Magnus. Another standard Barrow Magnus deck, a 1 TD uh, Barrow Magnus. One on the card, but the doll, I mean, one yeah, copy. The, the doll is kind of weird, but you know, it's only one copy. Mm -hmm. uh, second place was a me. A me with Magnolia. Okay, that's nice. Uh, just pure Magnolia. So, doing doing decent work, it seems. Um, and then, he's running defensive, tr defensive order. It's kind of interesting. Mm. And then, third place, we've got Brand Gate. We've got Prison. So, uh, good job. This is this is the key card with prison. Is he? This no. is Japanese, Wait. right? Where's Lamone? And no Rouge. Uh, maybe they they couldn't get Lamone in time. Oh. No Rouge. Whoa. Oh, this is kind of like a cheap, it's like cheap TD Rouge. Part. Kind TD of like plus. a cheap Rouge. Yeah. Yeah. And then um, I think fourth place was Token Rambo, but he didn't show it. Oh. <laughs> All right. Next one we have is Checkmate Vanguard. The first More place was Barrows. Barrow Magnus. Okay. Again. Oof. Uh, for just a standard build, standard mm. build. With, what's with the one? one yeah, they, they always run one, one of this. Interesting. <laughs> I'm seeing a pattern here. Yeah, I mean, this is new, new foreign tech, the West tech. All right, and then here you're, you've got the Tuny Clan at Imperial Games. First place was Doc DS Red Vanguard. Uh, yeah, standard Barrow, standard Barrow. No, actually no hybrid Barrow, kind of with hybrid defense here. Uh, second place was Stoike Magnolia. So again, pure Magnolia. I don't, what I'm to the what I'm to a right, Zorgnolia, yeah, man. Yeah, Zorgnolia is pretty cool. Yeah, what I'm to Zorgnolia boys. Uh, and then third place was Luke with Dark States. So mm. Previous guy was Tuny Meganink who came second, but third is Luke with just the Sten, standard Bruce deck. But I yeah, approve. Got right, all the Brodies, cards. Brodies, everything there. Good stuff. So yeah, that is basically that. Let's move on to the big big boy Bastions, Bastion. Bastion deck. Bastion deck, yes. Alright, um, I mean, we're seeing Dark Strains here again, remember? The, the trend was no Dark Strains mm -hmm. and Control, uh, but maybe that has changed. So this is just, this looks like just your pretty standard, bog standard beatdown. Full face. Yeah, didn't even run any new cards, right? Literally yep. just took his old deck and he's still topping, so Good on cool. Him. Um, second is a... Okay, it's got this, four this is of Control the, Bastion. Four of the bottom deck. Four bottom decks, four three of the, of the draw, one. four yeah. grade ones. So there's like a huge potential to miss here with Dude, your Bastion. It's crazy, it's actually cutting uh, crit triggers for a draw. So wow, <laughs> he's going into that full. Well, I, I've mode. seen I've seen them run more draws than than crits, mm. which is kind of interesting. But yeah, uh, this is lots of missed targets. I'm not sure what to think about this. 
Yeah, it's also not running any um, facade, so it's kind no of no facade. That's that's not yeah. cool. Really, really no facade. Wow, not a fan. Yeah, it's great three lineups a bit scuffed <laughs> for front row. I think this one's control again. He's running like two. But this is like control with Lapista, right? That's Lapista, yeah. yeah. The two facade, two Lapista. It's kind of interesting. Um, Next we have is another kind of, this is like semi-control, I guess. I mean, it's, <laughs> does this even count as control? Yeah, I think well, it is. Well, he's still running like TD Null, so I'm not sure. Oh, TD Nulls. No, that's because he doesn't want to get uh, cucked by God Restrict, right? The random <laughs> dolls. <laughs> sure. <laughs> All right, another kind of semi-control. This is control. Yep. C4 of this and it's like yep. instant control there. Four copies. Four Alphins, wow. He's really hmm. invested in that. Uh, another one, lots yeah, of Alphans, control, control, no Dark Train, so it looks like, feels like Control is still winning a big time. This is like kind of a hybrid, I guess, mm -hmm. only two Control, but you've got a bunch of, you know, top deck checks. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. Uh, dark Strain's back. Uh, this one, Control, mm -hmm. cool, three Alphans. Yeah, Bastion's super popular with the Control build now. This is just a beatdown one. Beatdown with like defense. 50k shield. Yeah, 50k mm -hmm. shield. We have 20k shields next set. Yeah. It was pretty cool. Fronts, yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, even even the orders have 20k shields. Uh, this is Control as well. So, dude, if you guys want Control Bastion, just look through all of these decks. And you they pick, do pretty much exactly Pick anyone. The same. Yeah. Uh, beatdown Bastion with like, you know, this it's is the old build where they run one off, one off that. Mm. Uh, witches? Oh, they're it's running cool. the, the three witches, eh? I'm not sure if it's really worth it, but hey. Mm, it's pretty soul heavy. It's pretty soul heavy. Yeah. Uh, and then we've got, moving on to English, we've got Xenon, Zenonstum, mm -hmm. Storm. Is control? With, with, no, I don't think they really play. Well, he runs two of these. Not the great one. Yeah. Interesting. But it's not, they don't really run, I don't think they run control builds in mm -hmm. English yet, mm -hmm. uh, which is fine. Uh, we got Doom here. Right, I think you say that this is English. Wow, okay. Yeah, this guy went Bastion Control. Alright, good stuff. Good stuff. I respect. Time. I respect. Alright. Use downswing twice in the tourney discard like 15 times. So I guess he wasn't controlling much. I mean, <laughs> those two times maybe you win the game, right? It's, yeah. It's yeah. like, you know, it's you, you you find the occasion to punish your opponent. And mm, mm, that's mm. that kind of card. Well, I think I cut like one. I, put, I play like three. three yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, uh, second, was it second place? No, he just, oh, he played a bunch of, you. first mm. place, nice, 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 good stuff. Uh, all right, so, uh, and then we've got another Bastion deck, David Ma, first our top three winning list in Edmonton. Mm. All right, so first is Bastion, which is him. Uh, just a smashing, smash down Bastion list. Is that, is that D for DJ? Yeah, D for DJ. Okay, all right, good, good stuff. Uh, second place was a Barrow Magnus with Jeremy. Mm. Uh, pretty standard Barrow, two yep. TD Barrow. Solid, solid. Very solid. They've been learning, all right. This and this is like hybrid Whoa. barrier, is it? Hybrid barrier, yeah. Wow. One TD hybrid barrier. <laughs> okay, and then we got a random hexa orb from Singapore. Mm, so, okay, uh, one represent. Is there actually, did we already see this one? I think, actually, I think we've we seen might this have one. Yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, I think it was from previous ones, but you know, since hexa orb doesn't get any sh showings, and he, here you go, boys. Yep. This is this is charity. Charity. <laughs> charity. Okay. Uh, okay, we got one Magnolia, uh, official Magnolia that came. I think first the other ones were just like taggers on. Yep. All right, so again another pure Magnolia list. So we like every week, there's like a pure one. Then the next week is Zorg mm. Zorgo one. Um, but speaking of Zorgo, we've got a bunch of Zorgos there. Oh really? Yeah, we've got got <laughs> one in Japan here. From Japan as well. Uh, Zorgo. They get new stuff from. Yeah, he's not running the. I think it's the high Hy like Hydro L Dragon, which can mm. bounce a. Like a grade three back from hand, so nice. otherwise it's just pretty standard, um, pretty standard uh, Zorgo list. Mm. Uh, next we have is another one from Japan, and uh, kind of not so standard, I guess. Yeah, He's running one Hydro Rail, like, like, random one offs, four of this. Uh, you know, go chase one copy of this. I think you you need to run more of this just yeah, so you like you rush, to see uh, yeah, just to push really early. He's running draws, which is pretty crazy. <laughs> um, but I guess if you want to push, then you got to run draws. Yeah. Uh, is he running any of the... Uh, yeah, he's running the Grudge, okay. So that's alright. Uh, next we've got Cardweeb. So I recognize his name. Yeah. He, uh, he does good, good, good stuff. Good stuff. Nice. Yeah, Learn this is the second approach. Like six draws. That's... No, wait, no, wait. Wait, wait. No, we're, we're thinking wrong. That's a front. Yeah, one draw. My bad. One draw. I'll, I'll think of Magnolia for a sec. No, that's not even a draw. That's a front. Front? It's a front. Oh my. Yeah. Colors. 
Like, oh, yeah, so very aggressive, very yeah. aggressive. Um, Sorgalis, this is what you want to see. Mm -hmm. You can run all this, all this and stuff. Nice grade two lineup. Yeah, grade two lineup is good. You can yeah. push early. So good, good stuff, good stuff. So you gotta remember with these three attack decks. Yeah, you, you, you have to catch up somewhere. That's right. Um, and then we got Shy. Uh, in game first, mm. it seems. So uh, good, good old Zorgalist. I like, I like the three, 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 four mm -hmm. kind of lineup. So uh, pretty good. Um, he's not running. Uh, he's not running. What was it? It's, it's, it's the, it's the Hen pink girl. Henrietta. Henrietta. No, this is Hendrina, right? Hendrina. Oh, what's the other one? Uh, Elenia. 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 These names, man. I feel like you want Elenia, but I guess you can mm. like you know use condensation of cold stuff. So that's fine. I guess it's okay. Yeah. Okay. Fronts all that crit. So yeah, this is, this is this is good times. Good times. Uh, two month long win streak. Okay. All right. <laughs> Pretty long win streak, mate. <laughs> uh, we have some prison decks. I thought we'd, we might see more prison decks, but mm -hmm. I think it just... It, like, after Lamone came out, I thought we'd see more prison decks, but it yep. seems like it hasn't really happened. But, you know, you've got Lamone, you've got this, you've got the old man. Mm -hmm. um, rest of the deck is pretty pretty straightforward. Again, mm -hmm. I still don't like four of this. Four of that is yeah, too excessive. excessive. I like just can I blue I thought, to draw. I always thought... Um, Bobble minus an instant four. No, he's got three. I mean... This deck it's itself, freak. Oh, this deck doesn't use that much CB except for drawing. Yeah, that's true. Um, they cut down, they cut down the defensive yeah, cards because they because they realize that you know everyone just called this stuff out. And this, yep. this you don't get the occasion to use it. And nice the Dennis, hey. The Dene GX is that? Yeah. yeah. Wow. GG Lamel. Uh, next we've got uh, Neil, and uh, this one is, is this a, uh, this is from a uh, Indonesia, right? Um, I'm not too sure actually. Huh. Possibly. I think we've seen uh, we've definitely seen Neil before. Mm. Definitely seen Neil before. But yeah, no. Um, correct, correct build here. You have to run that. Yep. I think he's basically done the cuts in the correct places. Um, and but overall, where's Bubble Mine? Bubble Mine? Nah, you don't need Bubble Mine. Oh, Bubble Mines. Okay, never mind. I mean, just no Lamone, but maybe Lamone still hasn't come yet. Yeah, I mean, finished <laughs> deliveries. Shipping. Uh, second place was a Bastion. Bastion. So yes, yeah, good old Bastion. Face. Yeah, full face Bastion. Hmm. And then third place was uh, Orphis. Brandgate Orphis. Okay, so we haven't really. There isn't really a, an Orphis deck it? this week. Oh. Orphis section, but you know, here it is. Here it is, guys. It was hiding. Represent. Yeah. <laughs> so Orphis. Uh, I. He's running one grade three. I know Orpha seems to have cut down like a lot of their auxiliary mm -hmm. grade threes just to put on more pressure early. Yep. Um, so that's where they're getting their gains from. All right. And then lastly, we've got uh, Aurora Battle Princess. Uh, well, name name's very long. Cold Klaus. Okay. Cold, Cold Klaus. Klaus. Okay. Uh, so yeah, there's your four burble means. There's mm -hmm. your four burble means. Uh, again, oh yes, three Kianai blues. I approve. I approve of this. I don't really approve of this guy. I think you can cut this guy down, run more other cards. Uh, I guess the question is what other cards? So I guess this is okay. <laughs> I guess it's okay. Until Limone comes out. Until the next set where well, they get like insane, insane like prison, mm -hmm. prison cards. So yeah, all right, good times, good times. Uh, and then we got some token decks. Mm -hmm. This is like, you know, TD token. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, this is a high rarity TD token, so this is actually looking very nice. <laughs> oh, actually, yeah. yeah Love those backgrounds. Pretty, yeah, pretty cool good. Background. Very stylistic. Uh, and then we got uh, oh, this Persona, Persona, Persona Ride token. Uh, we got another Persona, Persona Ride token. token. This guy's running one of the Cray, <laughs> Cray <laughs> Elemental Over Trigger. Kind of better, I can sort of see it. Yeah, he's like, screw the, uh, screw the trigger orders, <laughs> over orders. <laughs> and lastly, we've got another Persona, Persona. Ride token. So no Gilder Mesh token this week. Uh, it's pretty much just TD and uh... You, you know what these foils remind me of? Yeah? It's like, you know these Kantai arcade machines? Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> The yeah, background's yeah. like so similar. <laughs> I mean, it's the same kind it of game. It probably is the same. Yeah. It's probably, probably the, the same, same background. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, this week we got BSF O 2021. Oh yeah. Standard and VPREM. So, mm -hmm. you can do some homework. What decks are meta? Maybe a lot of people... Well, yeah. not that many people would play VPREM last week because they were busy, right? Yeah. With a PREM. So, uh, less decks and people can hide stuff. But this is an Ultimal deck. Ultimal and V-Prem. Uh, the deck just, the deck works because you got Edith. So if you really want to, you can try this out. Okay, if you're a you big, big Ultimal fan. If you're a big, big Ultimal fan. Uh, second place, uh, this is from Neil, by the way. So first, first place was okay, Gary so Stevanis. Yeah, yeah. 
Second place was Barawa Vegas with Norikami, so Vanquisher. Mm -hmm. Vanquisher still doing things. Uh, and then third place was Neil himself with Jin Harmske. Oh, oh nice. okay, okay, yeah. This is a the Culture Gorilla. Day. The Culture Gorilla. Nice push. Bam, bam, bam. You're dead. 11 attacks. Good stuff. So people people underrate this deck, mm -hmm. but it's pretty fun. It's pretty Eight fun. Eight front. <laughs> Eight front, that's right. You only want a front. Uh, we got some gold paladins. We got Spectral. Spectral yep. is pretty, pretty, pretty good. Pretty solid list. Yeah, I, I agree. I like this. I like yeah, this lineup. This, this lineup is like almost perfect. Ne nearly perfect, yeah. And then we've got Bram as well. You got the lineup going Same. as well. So good job. Some place like Dindrin though, it's a bit hard to trigger sometimes, but you know, can work. Yeah. So Bram came came first with Spectral Duke. We got Jan with uh with Nightmare Dolls. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Good stuff. Still no PR. Yeah. Well, they're showing us that you know they can just perform works. without works. it. So. And third, we got Glenn with Malkut. Oh, Mel Mel that's, that's a deck I haven't seen for a while. Oh, nice. it'll, be, it'll be interesting if he plays this for, for Premier, oh, uh, yeah. V-Prem, because I feel like it's going to go to time. <laughs> oh, true, true. I feel like it's it might go to time, deck. but you know, if I see you guys, if I see you guys on stream, you know, we'll know who it is, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got one Angel Feather, uh, <laughs> me Meta Angel Feather, look at this crazy stuff. Yep, just look at that 16 copy. 16 crit, that's right, that's where you want to be. And then we've got Bang Dream. Bang Dream. Oh, Roselia. This is Claret Sword, I think. This is the yeah. like uh, Roselia's Claret Sword. So, yeah. um, cool, <laughs> cool deck. Cool deck. <laughs> we got a random OTT. What? I, I don't know how this is still around, but you know, <laughs> pentagonal, oh, my pentagonal thing. Magus. This is Japan. This is Japan. Oh god, this is Japan. Yeah, pentagonal cool. Magus still still representing from 20, 2018. <laughs> uh, we got a DI list from Japan as well. Okay, this pretty this nice. is pretty standard. Yeah, list now, mm. nowadays. Oh, nice uh, sign play mat. What's with all these sign play mats? <laughs> In Japan, you can do a lot of things. Yeah, uh, we got a random Bermuda, so full oh, full plon. rarity like Plon. Yeah, actually, <laughs> plon, plon pretty, pretty still, insane. Like, pretty and he, big he, casino deck. He, he's like so rich, he's not even running Serena, right? <laughs> <laughs> all right, and then we got a Mega Colony. What? We got a random Gridora deck. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah. If someone plays this at V Prem, bro, you know you, yeah, you, you know you know you want to, man. You know you want to. Now we're gonna move on to like probably the biggest section of like the day, and that is premium, premium decks. Premium, the real big boy. There is actually a lot of premium decks today. Nice. Um, and a lot of them didn't actually top, but we're gonna feature them anyway, huh? just because. You what know, kind of you? It's it's the vibes, man. You know, last week everyone had fun, and yep. um, there's some. Pretty cool decks, so let's take a look at them. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got Sean. He he won his Calgary Shop League with good this run. thing. So this is pretty good. I think like with all the re like there's like reprint select, uh, not reprint <laughs> revival selection coming out very soon. Mm -hmm. So I I'm thinking a lot of these cards that maybe you're missing. Like I don't know. I don't know the cards, but like you know if you're missing maybe like a Melum or something like that, mm -hmm. you you might get it. Like Urwataza stand, you might get that. So, if you're missing a bunch of these cards, uh, you can pick them up. And Gear Chronicle's like, like a stride deck piece. You yeah, know. Gear Chronicle's pretty good. Um, yep. I mean, in terms of like, I, I think we're on the train where premium is like might get fixed, right? Yeah. Yep. So uh, balance it out. Yep. I mean, Gear Chronicle could be a contender to be a good deck. Just yeah. saying. It's like saying. you know, its toolbox is fine, has a nice yeah. curve. So. We've got two, I've actually got two Geek Chronicle decks today oh, as well. Impressive. Uh, we've got John Lebron as well. Oh god, I see Tempest um, just like... He went, this was, he played this at BSFO. I, th I think, nice. I think he got featured. I think he got featured. Was he the, I think he was the one who went Gear Groovy. It was like playing against Chaos. Hmm. And he went Gear Groovy to, co to copy, I th is this? Wait, do I see it? Yeah, yeah, I think it's, so he copies this guy. Ragnarok. Um, Ragnarok, which is strict zeros in history yeah. build. So... The Ragnar Clock, uh, you know, they can't go with zero, so the people run like zero nulls, so they can't go. <laughs> so we played against the Link Joker, and Link Joker hard guard, and he triggered a, I think a Dark States over trigger, right? So. <laughs> three crits. Yeah, three three crit, nice. three crits, and, and so, yeah, this is this is pretty funny. This Justice pretty, been done. Ragnar Clock, man, randomly became better because of V. <laughs> <laughs> How does that make you feel, man? <laughs> and he's running like. Tempest Spheres, yeah, I guess the, the yeah, get the heals, get yeah. the heals. All right, so that's pretty funny, pretty good stuff. Uh, next we've got Derek Dow, the traitor, Derek Dow. Bruh. Uh, he did pretty well, I heard. He came like fourth in um in AO and mm -hmm. third in NA with this deck. 
Nice uh, one. I mean, if you want to check, if you want to see his thoughts on this deck and how he became oh, a yeah. trader, you can check out our podcast, kind yeah. of podcast or meeting like that I posted yesterday <laughs> and um, just find out like his thoughts and going into well, Watch that video anyways, if you haven't. It's, yeah. it's a pretty cool one. Yeah. Like one, one of the things that's pretty annoying about like over triggers now in premium or in any format is like if you have sentinel restrict mm -hmm. it's pretty much like confirmed damage oh uh, yeah right and then this guy has a crit so it's like confirmed two damage which is pretty pretty lame like this if, if stuff gets hit in premium this one probably dodges the list so if you guys mm -hmm. want to build pale moon standard plus then you can build something very similar to this and just deck right. in over trigger and like yeah snap your opponent yeah in half. so kind of value if you like to if you like to become a complicated player a complicated yeah. player. Uh, Darker Regulars, right? This is Kuro Neko. Mm -hmm. um, this is what he used to top a... a is it Prim? AGC, yeah, AGC tournament? Yeah, okay. okay. So he, he loves losing to over triggers. Um, but yeah, DI. <laughs> They're reprinting Gastille Diamond Ass, so maybe... Uh, that feels maybe like it's such gonna, a mistake. Yeah, maybe they're going to dodge the ban list again. Dude. I love Gastille, <laughs> but like, I hate him. Yeah, it's like, it's like like one dimensional DI decks, kind but, of, yeah. you know, but I mean, you know we haven't seen the end of Kuroneko. He, mm, he did, mm. I think he did top over the weekend, right? So oh, he yeah. topped BSO 2021 EU Premium. Um, I couldn't use my arena map because of the legality rules. Why is that? Is that official or it's not? It might not be official. Oh, okay, it might not be. All right. What do they call? What is slash draw? What what, what is slash draw in um? Hmm? What's the what's the deck called Slash Draw? I have no clue. Never. Is it's not it's not Blade Master, right? Because it's BM stance. So is it it's not Glebnir. So what is Slash Draw? I don't, I don't get so, someone tell me what Slash Draw is. Slash Draw. Interesting. Slash well, draw. he lost to it in top A, so it's a top four deck. Yeah. <laughs> um but yeah, no, it, I think this is pretty similar to is it similar to the deck that he had previously? No, I think this went full on Brufus. Brufus, yeah, yeah nine hustler, things like that. So um Pretty, pretty good deck. Mm. Pretty good deck, I guess. Uh, it's it's it on point. Might dodge the ban list, so yep. <laughs> if you guys want to be one. lame, go for it. <laughs> Rami Labyrinth running away. Yeah, and then here's your bars. Okay, third place. BSF yeah. Online EU Premium. So we've seen this guy on stream. Yeah. Uh, should have should have sacked your rear guard. <laughs> yeah, that, I was I was gonna say that. Yeah. Uh, I but guess you know, you know when you're in the high pressure situation, yep. you, you, you yep. just you just don't. You go to autopilot and things like that. Yeah, happen. but like you, you you kind of like what you call it, um, is it, is it focus focus too mm, much on one no, thing? It, it's like in a vacuum, yeah. it is the correct move, but in cert certain situations, it's not. So yeah, or well, you're just thinking too hard on something. So. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, but good job on coming third. You smash, you smash solemn. <laughs> oh, you defeated Blade Master. Nice. Huh. I love it when like decks defeated Blade Master. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> this is a pretty. This is a solid. This is a solid DI deck as well. Yeah, so yeah. good you, check it. Like both these DI, DI decks that we saw before are they even the same? I think. I think. Um, it's very. He doesn't similar. run Burbo, right? I think. Yeah. Hmm? Oh no, he does. There no, we go. He got three Burbo. There it is. So I think they're, they're pretty, pretty similar. Much, they're pretty they're similar. Cool, yeah. Um, so if you want to get get a DI list that might yep. dodge the ban list, here you go. Uh, we got Genesis Loop as well. Um, this is your boss. So, oh, it's him again. Wow, he's been doing work. Oh, so was... NA NA or eleventh oh, place, eleventh place. Missed. That's okay. That's okay. Uh, yeah, barely missed. Um, Genesis Loop. It seems. I think it's different to. It should be different mm. to our one, right? I think. Uh, it's quite similar actually. Ah, I might have played against you. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I think yeah. the main difference is he's running Swamble. Bobo. Yeah. He's not running Platinum Wolf. Mm -hmm. He cut a witch for an extra grade three, extra grade three searcher, right? But the idea is there. It's pretty much. Yeah. No, he's running the he's running the wrong over trigger though. Uh, how much you know? Okay. Yeah. 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 No. Overall, the, the idea is the same. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, good job on eleventh. Eleventh. Mm. All right. Uh, and then, well, I think next we got Jaime. Uh, he's got yeah. Okay. Second place, bro. So, you nearly there, mate, but you did pretty well. Yeah, this was <coughs> the aggro version of the Fenrir. Yeah, not loot deck. This is actually it's, not a loot deck. It's it? very similar to Muhammad's one. They yes. both played kind of the same idea. Yep. It's almost like a almost like a standard plus deck. Wow, both Taro. both of these decks came second play, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> and they both lost to Nuadio. <laughs> Bro, Nuadio, his name. Ah, <clears throat> uh, yeah, but no, this is pretty good. It's like instead of a 
Gener Glepnia Loop, where mm -hmm. it can like randomly brick itself. This one has less chances of bricking. Yeah. But like, I guess I'm here to ban Vanicano, which is like right to the one, <laughs> copy. Oh, one, one, one brick card. So pretty yes. unlucky there. But overall, yeah, good job, man. Good job. Yep. Second place. Close game. Yep. Yep. Almost got it. Almost got it, dude. And then, I mean, he would have gotten it, but his opponent got cricket heal, right? Oh, that's Just true. Six yeah, damage yeah, heals I mean... him. Games it happens. Like happen, it like, happens when your opponent decides to like trigger like like, like a a god of nine. Like, yeah, it's Vanguard. It's Vanguard. Yeah. So fifteenth place, we got a Shadow Paladin deck. This is Kiri mm -hmm. at EU Premium. Uh, I mean, missed top card because he went five two. Oh, uh, think, yeah. Yeah. It's a lot of people's story, bro. Yeah, it happens. <laughs> Can't sometimes, but you know, if, you, if you X2, you have a chance of missing. That's, yes, that's yes. the reality, yeah. But here's the thing you gotta play it out to the final round because who knows, you might be the bubble. So, yeah, yeah, you it know. could be ninth as well. So, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, okay. dude. just keep playing. Yeah, yeah, just, yeah, oh well, but you did good. Uh, playing, playing Luad in a loopy day, in a loopy metagame, right? Yeah, <laughs> it's good. Yeah, good times, good times. Next, we got a we got a traitor again, another grand blue. Wow. Oh, talking about traitors, here we. Oh, yeah. Man. Remember how you want to play grand it's blue? Like, and you want to become a deck. traitor? I still have a deck. Wow. It's, 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 it's low rarity, though. So it's I'm low not, rarity? It's, yeah. yeah. Well, you have at least you have the hollow Beatrices. Yeah. Uh, so but, you're, uh, you're, you're nearly there. Do you have hollow Columbards? They're all in hollow. You mean not SP? SP. I'm not. I'm not made of money, bro. I thought you were a grand blue fan, man. Yeah, there's no one selling it. One and two, they're overpriced as heck. So oh, wow. And that you're just weak and materialistic, dude. I can just print. Cards. <laughs> oh, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> mm. But it won't be the same, dude. It won't be the same. Oh man, it's remote fight. It's fine. <laughs> oh wow, this guy. All right, we got Bermuda Triangle. We got Danimus came tenth in EU Premium Riviere. Spring Fest with Riviere. You bubbles. Oh, nice. All right, but uh, yeah, no. Th he says thanks to Ian TCG and the rest of the staff and judges oh, for man. Spring Tour. It's, it's true. It's Out true. Out of the two, re the three regions, I love EU tournament. So, like, yeah, the bot bot's the pretty bots. pretty overpowered, yep, man. Yeah, bot's pretty overpowered, I have to say. The, their Discord solid. Yeah. Uh. So. Riviere, um, Superior Ride Riviere. I haven't seen this in a while because mm -hmm. all I've been seeing is loops, and this but, doesn't loop. So, no, but this one just <laughs> smacks your opponent if they give you one CP. Yep, yep. Yeah, it's all right. It's it's good if you if you're not, if your deck gets banned, you can still play play oh, Riviere. He's also giving another shout out to Different Fight and Trans Garham, This guy oh. for the always amazing commentary on the Bush of Life. <laughs> 14 Commentating hours. For, was it 14 hours? Well, it was two regions. Oh, we started at, I think we started seven. at mid noon and then we yep. ended at like what 2 30 a.m. Okay, so that is 14 hours. Crazy. And it's only going to be worse <laughs> when Swiss <laughs> took like on Saturday. Oh, right? man. I mean, V Prem could be longer because Prism Mirrors can go for like yeah, yeah. two years. V Prem is very balanced uh. and the decks are <laughs> very swingy. So I'm like <laughs> super keen with like um, V. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, next one, we have, we have a lot of Bermudas. This is top 8, Coral. Coral? Uh, yeah, he hasn't been playing for a while, but he top top 8 with a nice. Coral deck. So, good job, dude. Good job. We've got a very fancy background. <laughs> is that like a table mat? Like, you yeah, know? I think it's like a dining table mat. <laughs> dining <something> table? <laughs> yeah. yeah, good job with Coral. Uh, mm -hmm. Still still kind of, still kind of like, pretty, pretty yeah. YOLO, right? Pretty, pretty like good old YOLO deck. Against, like, Coral. Yeah, you got triple criticals. Yep. It's died from two. Lol. Um, and then we've got a true Highlander ah, deck from this is I Talked to Chie. Nice. Uh, yeah, so this okay. is actually a I've Highlander been, deck. I've been looking for this list. When, when, when full Highlander, even the triggers, so you can actually uh, ride Frederica, mm -hmm. which is the, the, the stride. stride. Yeah. So you can what actually do that. Even, oh wait, no, the, the, the G Guardians aren't Highlander, but it's only there. The, the idea is there. <laughs> Yeah, but you know, um, dude, this guy like, SP'd everything, did he? Oh, Almost, actually, he did, right? nearly everything. Is I think. Olivia in the higher rarity. They should no, no, Tirua, Tirua has Tirua a higher rarity. Yeah, right? okay. So just Almost missing there. a few, getting there, getting there. Solid, solid. Um, so good stuff. Uh, got second place because Brand Gate over trigger in Dimension. <laughs> oh wow, that's yep. like twelve crits. But we'll get the next time. <laughs> that's, it. that's the spirit. <laughs> yeah, never yeah. give up. Yeah, so good stuff, good stuff. Um, representing Highlander. And then next we got Kagero. This is the scum of the universe that oh, needs to go. Bro. Well, so this is this is Chris Chalk, uh, the Red Flash Chalk. So he posted mm. his decklist last week. 
but didn't pro didn't only posted the triggers, remember? Oh. So he actually um. posted his full list now. <laughs> uh, so but he actually went top eight at EU BSF Online, so it was a it was a top deck. It was a top deck. Nice. Right? Uh, it looks like it's just playing the standard, like like standard, you know. Well, it's got belogs. It's got like some. Oh yeah, some no, it's got belogs. A eh? yeah, so that's that's okay. That's cool. Uh, belogs like, is nice. Nice splash. I got got denial griffins, the most important card in your G zone. <laughs> um, yeah, so overall, this, like this, this I thing needs to go, right? This thing needs to go. I respect people who play <laughs> less than 15, 14 stands. Yeah. So I can give you that. Uh, it's running twelve stands. But right? oh, no, yeah, eleven stands. Vision trigger go. should never draft check more than once a turn. Wow. Yeah. That's my final verdict. Do no one can change my mind. Do you know who else ran a deck? We got Karan Patel. Yes, I know. I ditched, ditched his Lua deck <sighs> bro, to run Blade Master. What happened I, to you, I bro? I saw, like, I was paired against Karan on the day, and he yeah. flipped, like, draft check like 10. <laughs> <laughs> but I was at grade 2, so I was just like, oh, I guess I'm going bonkers. So he says, I regret running the Cruel Dragons as they did nothing all day. Yeah. But it's supposed to, it's supposed to let you, help you on the, in the mirror, right? Does it help you in the mirror? No, 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 no. It doesn't help in the mirror because even if you go up into a cruel, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, the only thing that will pop out a card is is um is Blade Master though because mm. the Conroe is the foreigner. If you're like mm. playing against like a lot of other decks, they're not gonna pop out early. I don't think. Like, what Probably, Genesis yeah. Loop? Will they not? Will they pop out early? Sometimes they won't. If they know you're running cruels, right? They yeah. won't. Um. But I guess, and like against like normal decks, mm -hmm. you're gonna beat them anyway, right? So, well, he's running yeah, for, for heal. Yeah. Over. Okay, fair. All right. So like, yeah, it's 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 all right. It's it's a nice concept, but I think mm. like in practice, maybe it's not that amazing. Yeah. But the deck needs to go. It needs to go, man. Yeah. It just needs no, to go. Like, all no right. No more, no more blade master, please. No more blade master, right. man. It just needs to go. All right. Uh, next, we got a new Batama. Managed to get top eight oh, yeah, at I've AGC's tournament. Nice. Um, yeah, Jamu. Jamu needs to go. Do you think Jamu needs to go? Yeah, Jamu. Needs Jamu to needs to go. go but like, no, that's it, all right. <laughs> in, in any card game, though, you can just like slash your. I think hand. I think Jamu is a pretty badly designed card. Uh, the thing like, is, the, it's also the, time, <laughs> the the timing of the effect is like also super bad, right? Uh, it's like yeah. Right. It's yeah, right. but like if it's just at the end of the turn. It's like fine, whatever. I mean, he's running Magatsu. Magatsu is pretty solid. Yeah, Magatsu is pretty. I, I think like let's be real here. It's just a crow deck. Oh, well, to be honest, I don't think people's been like researching this deck mm. much. Like, yeah. so I think there's a lot, lot, lot of playability somewhere. It people just have to put in the effort to, to, to test it out. Um, but you know, why test it when you can play Blade Master? Or when or it's going to get bad. or loop, 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 loop. loops. Uh, we got Narukami, uh, standard, hey, standard Narukami. Cool. This is Miss Great King. Huh. First place. Oh no, Miss Grey King didn't play this, but it nah, was a Yomo. Was... Yomo 33 played it. Mm -hmm. uh, as you can see, it's just a very standard deck, and that's what Narukami is right now. The second, we got Card Dweeb. Uh, he's running Tachikaze. Anger Blader. Uh. Wow. Hmm. <sighs> Whew. Okay, nice. Nice job, bro. Uh, third place, we got a Miss Grey King Shadow Paladin. Mm. Uh, so he's got basically elements of every single deck out there. Yes. I remember this thing, th 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 this combo. Mm. Um, but you know, since Luage is a toolbox deck, you can do everything. Like farm the crows. Farm eagles. Farm the eagles. eagles. Uh, superior ride, multi attacks. You can do everything, man. Do yeah. everything. Uh, so good stuff. Wait, is he running the old Luage? Wow. <laughs> wow, crazy. And then our uh, fourth place, we got Robo Frenzy with Grand Blue. Uh, so this is more your traditional Grand Blue list, I guess, for premium. Yeah. Um, not, not like the control stuff that Solon was playing. Yep. But just the stand stuff. So is this Zazan? Is this Zazan? Yeah, there's yeah. a Zazan list. All right, so good times, good times. Uh, we got one random Link Joker that uh, top baited at AGC. So mm. I guess Link Joker is pretty good, man. I mean, it's one of those decks that like you just absolutely destroyed. Did you did you know this deck beats Chaos? I mean, Gize. <laughs> 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 yes. Yeah. Um. Yeah. No. This is Link Joker. Pure chaos. Pure chaos. Right. Pure chaos. Pure chaos. Yeah. Yeah. He's got like four clues. The clues are like really expensive now, man. It's like wow. you you want to play stand like you want to play standard chaos, but you don't have enough star faders, so it's like premiums. Yeah. That's <laughs> right. That's that's exactly. 
Man, uh, wouldn't it be nice if like the Link Jerkar revival selection had a bunch of Star Vaders in them? Hmm. Actually, how much is close at the moment? It's super like hard to get. It's like $60. Right? <laughs> 60? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, but yeah, I, I it, think it, it's something like it's something stupid like it, that. It, it was like hard to crack, I remember, like the set. But the thing is, like, it's a bit hard, like, it's a, actually a bit hard to use clues, because, okay, cool, you lock one from hand, right? Mm -hmm. But you use a soul, and, like, you do use, like, quite a lot of soul in this deck. If sure. you don't, if you don't use Zinx. I don't, I don't care, bro. Locking from hand out of top deck is, like, bullshit. Mm -hmm. No, but, like, you run out of soul, man. <laughs> you run out of soul. Like, that's fine. Chaos Vader needs to go. No, it needs to stay. It needs to stay, man. Change the effect. No more locking from top deck or hand. I'll yeah. be happy. But... Yeah, we should just lock from your stride zone. <laughs> lock from your right deck. Right lock from right deck. All right, next we got a Nova deck. This is looks like it's a Blau waifu deck. Ta, not you're, bad. You're the Blau expert here. What do you think? Not a Blau expert. I mean, there's only so much a Blau deck can do. Well, then, and... then what are you an expert at? Um... I don't know. Wow. I don't know. I'm questioning myself now. I thought you played Blau when you were a kid, and when you grew up, you just threw Blau into the trash. Have you played Blau on GB4 E, right? That was so... Fun? Anyways, <laughs> um, I don't know. What do you do with this deck? Get over trigger and hope... You can well, you know, I think everyone's just playing over trigger that deck. Of um, course. But... We've got another Nova list. We've got two Nova mm. lists. So this is the, uh, this is the weirder one. No, this is the one. Yeah, so you got- you run Gize, so you can access <laughs> other- uh, I mean, you saw my Nova Gize list, right? But this has a truly different idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. wants to go into, uh, Ultima, <laughs> so it can stack the Brant Gate over here, <laughs> and then everything gets double power. And you, had, you run meme. cards that, like, restand itself yeah. with grade 3. This guy restands itself. <laughs> so yeah. lame. So you run 2, because you call 2, yep, right? The and then stack yeah. 2. So you stack this and, like, yep. I don't know, this like, sort of crit. The deck runs no Axel. Literally, you just, like, yeah. ride, flip g and survive for a turn, <laughs> ultimate stride, and hope you win. Yeah, uh, pretty much. absolutely it. <laughs> Lamau. Oh, well. Lamau dot deck. Yeah, but look at all this, like, look at all these memes, man. Ultima with everything, dude. Yeah. Ultima with everything. Crazy. You don't even, yeah, this is just in your deck, so you can do this. You yep. don't even run, run yep. this just data. Wow. And then we got Deck Sander has shared us the, uh, the app, hmm. the results. So there's lots of Bastion for That's Post Festival. Collection. Yeah, Post Festival Collection is literally just Bastion and Bruce's. It's only 25%, bro. It's only, only five 25. more than Bruce. It's fine. Yeah, I mean, like, like what? Was it was it twenty five percent Blade Master or something in Europe Premium? Was it? I think it was something like that. Yeah. Only twenty five percent. Wait, no one, no one like won that one. So, no one, uh, wait, did any of them top? Yeah, two of them two top. Them top. All right. two, one or two top. Yeah. Or two okay. Top, yeah. All right. Yeah, that's, that's good. Good stats. And then lastly, we got a little message from our neighbor JJ. Oh yes. Co commentated, uh, commentated NA? the uh, NA yeah. NA with Peter. Uh, so I didn't have the energy to type this out at 4 a.m. <laughs> but I'd like to thank you, the community, for watching all of the Booster Root Online Remote Fight live streams and for all your support. Be sure to pay it forward and have a great week. Be awesome, stay, and have a wonderful day, JJ. What? That just kind of rhymes, man. <laughs> That's good. It's the same. I have the same sentiments. It's all you guys. Without you guys, we wouldn't have a tournament. So thanks for coming and chilling out. Uh, but. We also have just one more deck because some guy posted on Discord. All right. Uh, yes, and we always have to put them last. Uh, we got this one. Oh, okay. So just make it nicer. Hey, Magnolia list. Yeah. This is Zognolia. Oh, Zognolia. Is... Yes. Oh yes, finally. Oh, finally, see? one one this week. Uh, it the dream it's wasn't done. dead. It's yeah. Done. Okay. He's running extra orders though. He's got eh, two calls of beasts. Fine. So. You can you can run it. I mean, next set. Magnolia's looking really strong with those new old Yeah, so. actually Magnolia and Zorgo is looking very strong. So nice everyone better. everyone get your green decks out. Yep. And uh, enjoy. Put so, some blues. Uh, yeah, that's right. So you know, that's actually a pretty good timing. Uh nearly fifty minutes. One of the shorter ones recently, but I can imagine next week could be longer. Mm. Are you ready? Get ready. You you're gonna take a few days off leave. Yeah, yeah, you know. And it's probably gonna be cold next week, so make sure to wear your shorts, get your hoodies on, and stay prepared. So uh, yeah, get some sleep, guys. If you're joining the tournament, I don't know. I think mm -hmm. you can still change a deck, right? So maybe if you, you see can, this, yeah. and then you go, oh, wow, my my deck. I need to change it. Inspiring. 
Dude, I think V-Prem is literally capped every single region. Wow. Yeah, like an over over capped, it's like 160 I mean, out of 128. Gotta say like V-Prem is probably like the most devil event. Like it's so, it's yeah. actually balanced and fun. Um, yeah. You can enjoy every game. So hope these guys, hope these decks helped you out. If you want to do any changes, you better make it mm -hmm. fast, right? Better make it fast. Cause I'm going to spend some time editing this, by the time I post it, <laughs> oh man, you guys might not have that much time. Hours. Yeah. So if you want to make changes, do it quick, but otherwise, Good luck in the tournament, yep. and hopefully I will see you guys on stream. One more thing, if you can't join the tournament for whatever reason, go watch the stream. It's actually super exciting. Yeah. There's a lot of people in the chat. It's lit. Yeah, and if you can't watch it, just join the stream. <laughs> <laughs> leave it running so we're getting views. <laughs> Come on, you gotta support, yeah, support the community. The community guys. Um, well, oh. But also make sure to give Bruce feedback. Oh, yes. Uh, if you give them, like, they just want to know how it, it's like the whole tournament is. Mm -hmm. And look, if it goes well, and I think a lot of people like surprisingly like the tournament. Yes. At first they were like, oh it's wow. A lot of skeptics. Yeah, goals. it's an yeah, online yeah, tournament, who cares? But after the tour, after it's really happened, everyone's like going, wow, this was yeah, actually, actually really legit. fun. Yes, I yes. can actually talk to my friends again and talk to new people. Yep. So it's actually been really good. Yep. So let them know. Like, and yeah. you know, it might just be a thing that they mm -hmm. do. Hey, you, you know? get to play with overseas people and not yeah. have to Play, pay the flight ticket or the hotel ticket is actually amazing. Yeah, that's right, that's right. So, so, yeah, that's it from us. Let them know. Remember, VG Top Decks, hashtag VG, VG Top, Top Decks on Twitter, or you can post it on Discord. But remember, if you put it on Discord, you're getting it. Your, your deck list is last. Maybe Literally they want last. the last shot. And maybe they, they the do. Most view time. They got the most view time. Um, but you know, if this becomes a thing, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna <laughs> you gotta have to redo these. Oh man! <laughs> right, okay. that, that's that's your word. I'm gonna we'll, randomly put you somewhere. We'll deal with it when it comes. <laughs> but, all right. Till then. All right. See you later. See you later, everyone. And see you at BCF Online. Yes, that's right. BSF Online. BFS. Oh God. No, B, yeah, BSF. BFS. Not no, BCF. Spring Fest. Spring Fest. Spring Fest. Spring Fest Online. Yeah, see you right. there. Bye. Bye.